Hi guys, 57 Fordman here. I'm uh, got a box in the mail a couple of days ago from uh, Mountain 66 Diecast, Todd. Uh, we were talking one day and uh, he had got some dollar cars and uh, that he had picked up at um, a thrift store or value village or something like that and uh, he was showing them off and he was mentioning that uh, he might put some of them in his junkyard and if you've seen his junkyard it's pretty cool um, you might want to go check out some of his uh, videos on his junkyard because he changes it updates it pretty much and this is why he was getting these cars well he mentioned to me that uh, he was gonna send me some cars because I had asked him about these particular ones that he was gonna put in his junkyard and he said he would send me some so this is a video of what he had sent me so first off I have this byway it's in pretty good shape for me because I collect black walls and I have quite a few of them and this particular one is better shape than the one that I have and I also have a blue one that uh, is in pretty good shape but uh, missing parts like windshields or something so but uh, there was that one and these had, we'd been talking about different ones that he had he has already in his possession and these were extras and stuff like that so the next one I didn't have this one I have this one in a different color but this is the Sun again and it's missing the roof but all in all it's in pretty good shape for me um, I have like I said I have the blue one which is also missing the roof now what I mean by missing the roof is like there's a plastic piece that goes in here that lifts up so <clears throat> but I didn't have this particular one so Todd sent it to me and this is a Peugeot that I did not have and this was another one that he was thinking of putting in his junkyard so I have a brown one I believe but I didn't have this blue one so I do now which is very cool thank you very much Todd okay uh, then to my surprise he uh, had some extras in the box which kind of shocked me this one here I hadn't I never even seen this one before but this was super cool I just love the color of this thing and uh, I have I think three or four now of these Nova wagons I think I have the orange one with flames and the orange one art car one I think I had two of the art car ones and I painted one of them blue so I think I have four now I think the color of that is just gorgeous <clears throat> pardon me don't mind my cat being a whiner now this next one I did not have it in my collection and this was carded but like me I don't collect cards so opened it became 
and that's the 66 Nova which is very cool I like this this looks awesome I have uh, three of these one you may remember I turned into a gasser or is trying to and one other one I had two this kind two of this kind two blue ones with the white stripe now I like it but I have another one that has like a black bottom on it and I didn't like it so I'm changing it change the base I don't know what I'm gonna do with it I don't have a chrome pen but I have silver so I'll probably just clean it up that way but this one here is a really really nice car I like that a lot then there was this one which I think it's called the Gatsby I'm not real sure but uh, yeah I'm not real sure um, doesn't really matter but it's kind of cool not something that I normally would collect but uh, when I keep looking at it it grows on you so thank you again Todd now this next one just huh, threw me for a loop this one is super cool this is a green light this is a 69 Buick GS and that is cool it's got an opening hood that doesn't open very far real riders really nice heavy but uh, that was very nice very nice of Todd to send that to me very cool now then <clears throat> there was mention of a super vans that he had gotten and lo and behold this one is now in my possession it's a little rough but uh, a little work it can come around and uh, I do have black walls that are loose that I can change put nicer looking ones on here and maybe maybe give it a paint job make it look make it look pretty cool but that's a nice one I like the I never turn down a black wall I collect all of them doesn't matter what shape they're in like I said I have cases of them this one another cool one and I did not have so this is new to my collection of black walls it's rough but when you don't have one this one's pretty cool so thank you very much Todd um, Todd had asked me if there was any cars that I had that were junkyard worthy and if if I had some stuff that I could send him for his junkyard I said sure I'll find him stuff and I have a few right now that I will send you Todd but I want to wait till I get enough to ship if you don't mind it'll be shortly be soon anyway now I just want to show you what new vehicles I have picked up in my last little couple of days Ford Ranchero my brother-in-law got that for me um, wasn't even expecting it I have a I have a black one it was in a 10-pack 
And I think I have another one, but I can't remember where it is. But I like this green one. It's not that bad. And then I picked up this Mustang. It's, uh, I can't remember the series it's from. And then, this Ford Focus, which I really like, but they've made it a little bigger than the ones that I've previously have collected. more. This is my first one of these. I was a little disappointed after finding it because it's very narrow. It's a th like the size to you know it just doesn't look right. I don't know if the Hot Wheel one is bigger but this is the Matchbox version and it just seems smaller for a truck. It just it, to me it just seems th too thin too narrow so but I have one now I never had one before so that's the Dodge A200 and this last one I noticed a lot of collectors were picking it up and I I seen it on theirs and I thought I gotta get one of them and this is the London taxi I think it's pretty cool but, uh, nothing spectacular about it it's just a cool little car and I had to have one for my collection so those are my new finds and my mail-in box from Mountain 66 diecast Todd thank you very much Todd it was awesome box it was an awesome box I'll get you uh, I have like I said I have a couple of junkyard cars for you and I'll get them together with a, some more that I, I know I have and I'll get them off to you thanks again peace